Introduction to the CXE Learning Hub. The CXE Learning Hub is located online at learninghub.cxe.org. The CXE Learning Hub is an online platform where students may access resources for all levels of subjects or examinations. You will find resources for CAPE, CSEC, CVQ, CPEA, and CCSLC subjects. Some resources that may be found on the CXC Learning Hub are past papers, subject reports, digital toolkits, and practice tests. Resources for the digital toolkits are created by the teachers across the region. The teachers are familiar with the content that is needed for each specific objective of their respective syllabus. Some resources are free and others may be purchased from the store. For example, textbooks and past papers are for sale. We want the CXC Learning Hub to be that one-stop shop for all of you, our students. If you have an account already, go ahead and sign in. Otherwise, you will need to sign up with basic information. So first name, Last name, email, password, a date of birth. Also, when you enter, you will be asked to supply the name of the school or to select the school with which you are affiliated. When you enter the CXC Learning Hub, you will land on the subject dashboard. There you will see the different menu items to choose from. Syllabus, resources, classes, assessment, and my reports. Clicking on the syllabus tab will provide the option for you to view the syllabus as flipbook or to download or view the syllabus as PDF. The overview of the syllabus is there on the front of the page, so you can also read for your information. Here on the additional math resource page, you will see all the resources for additional math, as you will for any other subject dashboard you are on. You may click on the tile to access the named resource. So here on the English A and B resources page, if you click on subject reports, you will see a listing of subject reports which are available both as flipbooks and PDF documents. Looking inside of a subject report, you will find very important notes about the overall performance of students on each question for the named exam in the selected year. There are general comments, detailed comments, a deep look at how each question should have been answered. Sometimes they contain exemplars, but all will provide recommendations for teachers and students as they attempt similar questions or study similar concepts. Subject reports are very useful. There are digital toolkits for each subject on the CXC Learning Hub. Click on Digital Toolkit from the Resources page of the selected subject. Select the resources you want from the list under each section. Some examples of digital toolkit items are simulations, web pages, videos, infographics, notes, lessons from PowerPoint presentations created by teachers. In fact, the resources in the digital toolkits are provided by teachers to satisfy the specific objective of each syllabus. The items in the digital toolkit are peer-reviewed, validated, and verified in order to ensure that they are fit for purpose. There are classes that may be set up on the CXC Learning Hub. Teachers may create lessons with content, assignments, and activities for students to access, or they may create live classes. 
supply the students with the class code and students will then navigate to the big blue button which is an open source video conferencing tool fit for the classroom. Finally, the CXC Learning Hub store. In order to access the store, you may click on My Store, or you may also enter the store by clicking on an item from the resources page. The store is easy to use and requires that you click on the item that you want to purchase, then view it in your cart and proceed to checkout. When payment is made, you may go back to the resources tab and click on the item again. It will become visible on the page and you will be able to access. The CXC Learning Hub has a lot to offer, a lot of help and support for our students. Mm -hmm.